This isn't going to be one of my normal videos on the channel because in this one it's sort of going to be commentary wise because we're here to talk about the town hub on Roblox and also pretty much like the whole commission thing um, and like you know why I think the town hub is probably the worst place where you can actually get uh, you know a job or so like even hire people um, because I've actually have two friends who pretty much got scammed within like the same month on this thing. And it's actually insane because, I mean, these people, they're just going to get away with it. They're not going to get banned off of Roblox because, like, the report system is pretty garbage. And so I just want to talk about the Talent Hub at this point because, personally, I've used it, I believe, like, five times at this point, uh, maybe even more. And out of the few times I used it, maybe, like, I used it, like, probably, like, six times. Like, maybe, like, I did, like, four successful commissions at this point. And I think out of all of them, I've gone scammed once, which is really not a good ratio. I mean, a one to five, that's like a 20% chance or something to get scammed, which is really not good. And the person that actually scammed me, they were a verified person. So it's insane how people can be like verified, like Roblox on the town hub, they treat verified people as if, you know, they're highly respected. They're like, you know, amazing people and like they aren't gonna scam you. But no, in order to get verified, all you have to do is just pretty much get a passport or like a license and you'll be able to instantly verify i'm not verified because uh, i don't feel comfortable sharing with that information to roblox but the, the people who do then they're verified and their posts are the ones that get shown to unverified people because if you didn't know if you're unverified you can't actually see unverif other people's unverified posts it's just not how it works um it's it's kind of unfortunate like i don't even know why they do that like once again the person who scanned me they were verified like it was it was um, i'm 100 certain they were verified uh, because i would have not seen their posts if they weren't verified because I'm, i myself i'm not verified and so if you actually go to find jobs you'll pretty much be uh, greeted with the relevant sort first so if you you know don't go through any of the filters or anything you'll see relevant first and the relevant ones they're not really relevant i mean there's like posts from like months ago i really don't think that's relevant at that point unless it's like some huge studio that's still looking for people if it's like some small team or something usually by the time it's like two weeks later or something they're not going to be looking for more people they might have even done the task themselves at that point you know maybe these people forgot to delete the posts which is totally understandable but at that point i'm not sure why roblox would be pushing these out to just pretty much everybody because i mean i actually just looked through these like when i was just unaware uh, that these were like two months old i thought roblox would just show me like the best ones for me three months old like f like there's a lot and like there's some like a few days ago which i mean are still good but you know the relevant ones there's just still a lot of like month old ones and i think roblox needs to get rid of those like if there's a post that's like i guess over a, a few weeks old they should just get it rid of it out of the relevant sort um or something like that i know that after like a few months the job applications get automatically deleted but that's still not enough like i feel like they should just actually uh, you know to put in a little bit of work and actually uh, fix up the relevant sort also a few months like like probably a few months ago pretty much the inbox was like almost like it's still glitched out the inbox in town hub it's still pretty glitched like sometimes it's going to say job deleted when the job isn't deleted like it's just strange for some reason and it like tells you that the person like i know message like like pretty much the whole system inbox system is still a mess it's way better than it was before it's still a mess though and this brings us to pretty much the reason why i'm making this video because two of my friends have actually gotten scammed now i'm not sure if they got scammed on the town hub which you know maybe they haven't gotten scammed on the town hub but i personally have gotten scammed from the town hub and let me just tell you something that I think this is probably the worst place to actually look for a job. Because if you get scammed, you are pretty much, you know, you're, you're, you're pretty much out of luck if you get scammed here. Because yes, you can report people who actually, you know, if, if they did scam you, you could report them. Nine times out of ten, Roblox isn't going to do, do anything about that, really. I mean, their moderation isn't perfect, but it's also, like, not even good. And also, most of these, like, if I go into, like, in my inboxes and, like, you know, I go through, like, some of these messages, people ask me to, like, go on third-party apps, which at that point, if you go on a third-party app, you are pretty much done. Like, you, there's no way these people are going to get banned off of Roblox. You pretty much lose all of your chances of that once you get off uh, this, you know, town hub to, like, places like Discord, which is pretty much where I got scammed. Uh, thankfully, it wasn't a huge commission, 
um, which is you know great that you know if it, if it was a huge commission, I would definitely have done something about it. And this is why I think the town hub is just probably the worst place you need, uh, you know pretty much find a job. By no means am I saying town hub is actually a you know a horrible way to actually find jobs. I'm I'm just saying it's the worst way um, out of you know the other two that I'm about to show you, um, which both actually are on Discord. So if you aren't on Discord, um, then I mean, you can't really follow this. But it's going to be hidden devs or road devs. These are like two pretty popular um, Discord servers where you can actually find work. And the reason why I find these two outstanding is because they actually do something about getting scammed. Like I know hidden devs. I actually uh, I, th I think I hired someone before on here, uh, and this and in this place um, they make you like a dedicated channel and pretty much any moderators or whatever they can actually follow the channel so if the person like scams you or something like that they'll definitely be able to take action which is pretty great and then also on rodevs i'm not sure if hidden devs has this the same rodevs is pretty much it's actually the discord server by the dev king if you guys don't know who that is it's tap water you know you can look for hire or like you know put on some job listings and if you actually put yourself on hire it actually gives you a review like if you have if you have at least one review, it's going to give you a review thing so you can see how good like or like how reputable a person is. And once again, I believe they do have the same sort of feature that uh, Hidden Dev has where you can actually just chat with a person and everything is pretty much logged. So if they do end up scamming you or something, then they're pretty much either going to get a banned or they're going to get a horrible review, which is pretty much going to hurt the person a lot more now i know rodevs doesn't actually do anything about like they can't actually give you your money back like you know the scammer got away with it they i mean they got away with it i'm not sure about hidden devs it might be the same thing but you know in all three of them apart from you know the town hub the town hub if you contact roblox support after they ban the person like if, if they even ban the person at all you might be able to get your stuff back here you aren't going to get your stuff back but on these two discord servers it's going to be a pretty much like a 90% chance that the person's going to get banned from the server if they do end up scamming you. And that's great because it just gets the person off of the Discord servers. And these servers also give you some like tips on like, you know, what what would consider like to be scamming and stuff like that. So I definitely do recommend that. And so to conclude this video, there's not really like the perfect place to actually find, you know, a job or work. But I think your best bet is going to be through a Discord server because this creator hub thing it's not really great like you won't you aren't even going to find every single job post like on the discord server you're going to find you know pretty much it doesn't matter like you just have to be pretty much a, a server member and you are going to pretty much be able to find the listings there while here if you're not verified you're pretty much left with a gate right here with just verified people and these verified people they're pretty much i mean roblox is kind of scamming you in a way because they're verified you know they have the check mark and stuff but they can still end up being scammers which is definitely a loose situation especially with the fact that roblox puts these people out like these scammers and whatnot but they don't put out unverified people who just don't feel comfortable sharing their stuff on roblox and so it doesn't matter if you're trying to hire someone or you're looking to get hired it's pretty much going to be the same situation for you because you can get scammed either way and just a big issue just wanted to cover here because it's something that not many people have actually uh, you know talked about and so I just wanted to talk about this really quickly definitely not part of my you know normal content on this channel and also you know, if my mic is bad that I mean I apologize I'm doing this on my laptop right now with that make sure to like and subscribe and I'll catch you guys next time peace